Democrats. Hello. It is an honor to represent Arlington in the House of Delegates. I am proud to be the Democratic nominee for the 45th Delegate District. My family and I believe in this community. We're invested in the schools, we're invested in the small businesses, the community groups. We, just like you, want this community to thrive. And I'm especially lucky to have such a great group of colleagues to serve with. They did a lot over the last year to show me the ropes in Richmond, and for that I'm very grateful. We got a lot done, and I'm proud of our first term. I'm especially proud of the work on transportation and Medicaid, which gave all of us a glimpse of the opportunity for problem solving and working together that we all so desperately want to see in America. The question for Virginia is whether that opportunity and compromise will continue. Recent events <laughs> call into question, <laughs> recent events call into question whether the politics in Virginia are open for common sense compromise and problem solving. The Republican statewide ticket <laughs> represents the most extreme of radical divisive politics. These guys come from the most extreme elements of their party. They are the just say no caucus. When it comes to solving problems, they have other things to do. But we all know that jobs and the economy are problem number one, and they permeate everything we do, from education to transportation to equality. But when it comes to jobs, the other side only has one answer. Unpaid for tax cuts that miraculously are exactly the same amount that we just raised transportation funds by. Instead of moving backwards on transportation and infrastructure funding, we have to move forward. Getting this right is the cause of the next four years. This is critical to our state's future. But the other side is a lot more interested in what happens in places like this. When we should all be much more focused on this, because education is the jobs issue of the 21st century. in our teachers, we've got to reform our tests, and we've got to make sure we have the best system of higher education in the country. While the other side looks at this picture and sees someone to blame for all the challenges we face, we should look at this picture and see potential and opportunity and hope and commitment. This is the Virginia of the future. A lot of the debate in Virginia comes down to what the future for this little girl is. Where some people see very limited potential. <laughs> We all know that education and health care and equal rights and equal pay and the ability to make her own health choices, she can do anything. While the other side is busy planning weddings <laughs> and thinks this is how America gets stronger, we all know that the America dream is strong because of the search for hope and freedom and opportunity that comes from our diversity. It is that constant struggle. And in America, one of the big challenges today, and one of the big debates, is what a family is. As the son of a single mom, I and all of you know that family comes in many different forms. But it is the cornerstone of our communities, it is the thing that makes us strong, it is the jumping off point for opportunity for everybody, and we should be doing all we can as a country, as a state, and as a party to strengthen families in every form they take. because of the jobs it creates and the lifelong love and learning and opportunity it provides. While the other side just keeps coming back to this. <laughs> and it makes you want to scream because we've got a lot to do and the list keeps getting longer. We have 37 Democrats challenging Republican seats in the House of Delegates this year. We have a real chance to turn the tide on Virginia politics if we all just come together and get it done. We have a battle in Virginia about the opportunity for our future. It's a battle about jobs, it's a battle about families, and to win, we have to turn out the vote like we never have before in a gubernatorial year. So the question for all of you <laughs> is, are you ready? Yeah. 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 yeah! We've got a fantastic gubernatorial candidate. We have great lieutenant governor candidates. We have great attorney general candidates. I want to hear it one more time. Are you ready? Yeah! yeah.